Hallelujah. Glory to God. This is Prophetic Intercession with Amel. You are welcome. If this is the first time you're seeing me, the first time you're coming across my channel, God bless you. Thank you so much for stopping by. I pray that God will use this channel to minister to you in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. God gave me this prophetic word for someone. He says, this is why your miracle was delayed. This is why your miracle has been delaying. The Bible says in the book of Psalms chapter 31, it says that God leads us into prepared blessings. God leads us into prepared blessings. So why you are thinking that the miracle is delaying is because God is actually preparing the blessing for you. And sometimes it might take longer because when God is preparing that blessing for you, you yourself, you've got to be prepared to enter into the, the blessing. If God leads you into a blessing that you are not ready to handle, it's going to destroy you. So sometimes why it takes a while for God to prepare your blessings, you yourself, you delay it by not preparing yourself for the blessing. And God cannot have you ruin what he, he has already prepared. If the, if the Bible calls it prepared blessings, it means it takes God some time to prepare it. And God will not have you ruin that blessing. So he would he would have to take you through a process of preparing you for you to be able to accommodate or, or to enjoy the blessing that he is giving you. So most at times we delay our own miracles by not preparing ourselves for what God has for us. So what are you supposed to do now? You've got to get yourself into position. You've got to prepare yourself for everything you are believing God for. If you're believing God for a spouse, you've got to prepare yourself to accommodate another person in your life and not be a burden to them. If you're believing God for a job, you've got to prepare yourself to add value to that organization where God will give you. If you're believing God for whatsoever, you've got to prepare yourself so you don't become a ridicule to the very blessings or the miracles that God brings your way. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you and keep you, cause his face to shine upon you. May he be gracious to you and give you peace in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen.